Okay, down but Oh my Oh my god <laughs> What? The beam You think that's a beam? I mean that was a hundred that was a hundred damage right there. Oh look right there. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> you're good, you're good. 400 builds, 400 builds. All hard mats, all hard mats. It pulls that way, you have 120 builds. You're top nine, yo, top nine. So a lot of people want to know what finals actually looks like. And I know a lot of people watch Twitch streams and all this stuff, but to watch it real time in a call with someone, I definitely want to start doing this more often. Sniffer Rooney, he got 10th place in this cash cup. Keep in mind, that was the opens. Now we're watching the finals. And he hit me up and he asked me if I wanted to coach him. I decided to say yes, because I figured I can learn a thing or two, maybe by just watching and I can help him along the way and try and get some more earnings. You guys know there's six games in a finals cup. Not waste anyone's time. You might've noticed this video short. I'm just showing you the one or two games that were pretty good and the rest we're just kind of chalk. There was some good mid game fighting in there though, so I will include that. So stick around towards the end of this because afterwards I'm going to give my thoughts on what I learned just from watching. Yeah, these kids might have moved. Nice. You pause for a second. A sprint jump, and you're like practically there. Memis, metal, clutch. I think you stagger for a little bit. Save mats. You have only brick. Only brick right now. You have 60 mats. Four builds. Four builds. You have a Memis to play too in zone. No! Wasn't the best first game we know. That's why I kept it short. But this game was the pop-up. And I literally mean go crazy. Pretty sure the whole bottom is metal, but... Is it? Oh, nice. The guy coach. That's what I'm here for, Indeed. man. I'm here to call out these metal farms. <laughs> I am, I am, I am, I am. Oh. Oh. <laughs> so we got a little quiet time here as Stiff Keys, this guy. And I just know, like, I don't know. This is just the way he plays, but he's really good at He literally just yes, shoves sir. his face into any wall and just pickaxe and constantly on people's box. You'll notice all he's doing is just trying to literally run at him and just 50-50 because he has a massive health advantage. Watching this, though, like, I just wanted to scream at him to reload his pump. <laughs> But obviously, he's been in this situation multiple times. If I were to pretty much say anything at this point, it would just be annoying to him. So I calmed it as calmly as possible. Got one pump bullet. Good stuff, nice. bro. 300 above. Nice, bro. You had no brick, though. Oh, I should have calmed you to use a different mat or something. Or should I go right or left? Uh, I'm thinking... I'm thinking right. I bet. Yeah, I was going to say right too. We are chilling. We just need brick on the way. None of this stuff is in zone, so these kids shouldn't be here. But you never know. Yeah, I think this kid right here definitely is. I'm just going to... Yeah, I, I easily get him. It's probably going to go... I can already tell it's going to go like right here. And if it is, it's tilted. You can easily get him with all the builds. I don't know, bro. It might pull this way. Not nice. bad. No, That's, clutch. Go left. That's clutch. That's clutch. Hey, look, it's so free over there. Rotate. Everyone's going to need surge. Oh, wait. I'm going to need surge. You're good. You got zone, yo. You got zone. Let's go. All right. Should I get up one more for surge? Yeah, yeah. Do it. Do it. Do it. Yeah, body that. Yeah, spray him, spray him, spray him. Let's go! Chugs? Uh, pick up SMG. Yeah, nice. Chugs. Oh my god. Oh my. This is so clutch, bro. This is huge. Let's go. Okay, I build bro. up one box anyway. I'm bucking this off, bro. Right? Yeah. It is so laggy, bro. It's unspeakable. Yeah, this guy's trying to fight, bro. Um, no. It's so laggy, bro. Holy. Yeah, you grapple this. Just forget the wood. Nice. Nah, already got more points than last game. Let's that's go, bro. This is huge. It? You got this. You got everything you need. Yep. Get up. Really good spot. Only connected by one floor. Nice. That's nice if kick comes. All right, bro. Let's go. Stagger and use that grapple. One more stagger, you're in zone. Don't overbuild. Okay, bro. Nice. You're in here. Juiced on mats, bro. You got this. Unlimited SMG ammo. I'm in this, baby. Come on. You got this, bro. Close max. Try and get up, try and get up. So you can grab it. Nice.
You got this, bro. Heal when you get a chance. You have three hard builds. Nice. All right, all right. You can grapple again. Probably from this box, but you gotta be careful. You might be sandwiched. Good stuff, bro. Med missed. Okay, just go. One hard box after this. You have three hard builds. Three hundred fifty builds, all wood. You can look down here. Nice. Good stuff. Oh, can I go for it? No, 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 no. If it's zone, if it's zone, I'm. S it is zone. Oh, nice. Wait a second. Wait a second. Charge to it a little bit. Maybe one box. I'm making two, bro. No risking. You have a hundred, hundred fifty builds. Look for those mats. Nice, you're good. You got two, three, four hundred builds, four hundred builds. All hard mats, all hard mats. Nice. You have 150 builds. Look for a kill here, you'll get siphoned. Armor wall that, forget that kid. It pulls that way, you have 120 builds. You're top nine, yo, top nine. Top eight, top eight. One box, one box. You have three builds. You have a hard wall too. Be careful with your head. You have a hard wall. If you get this kill, you might want to run in zone for the mats. Good stuff. Nice. That's yeah. You might you need those mats low key, but forget it. No builds. You're 200, 200. You're crazy! You're crazy! You didn't get any mats! No, bro! Top fuck. three, bro! Let's go! After this amazing run that Stiff had, he managed to get fourth place at the end of this. Going into the rest of the games, I'm not going to showcase them too much because Stiff didn't do that great. Rotates on these further zones were definitely a little bit of a problem, and it made him super scuffed going into some of these end games. But his final placement is at the end of the video. I'm going to talk about while the rest of this plays out, the things that I learned and the realizations that I came up with, and probably answering the most important question in this video. How hard is it to actually make money? Now, when it comes to East, East probably literally might be the easiest one. Pretty much all you have to do is just get one solid game to get like top 40 and you can make 200 bucks now on west you need top 12 so that one's a little bit more difficult and on eu you need top 55 so it's easier on eu now i will say that that means you pretty much have to play damn well perfect on any server that doesn't have a large amount of people playing on it like west oceana brazil so if you're lucky enough to make it on an east or europe server the likelihood that you make money i would say is pretty high as long as you have literally like one decent game so with a little bit of luck on your side and some good planning i definitely think it's possible for literally almost anyone that practices this game to make money on those servers. Some of the crazy things I noticed since I haven't actually watched one of these games and coached someone was like when Stiff was landing off spawn, we were talking about it and literally if and depending on the lobby of where you're at and who's landing around you, no one takes fights. They, all they do is just crack you and they just run away. Obviously, Surge is a big deal, but there was times in the game where Stiff literally got hit for 150. The guy was like 20 meters away, didn't get pushed. Obviously, this depends on where you land, who's landing around you, like I said, so it's a little different for everyone, but that's nevertheless kind of crazy to think about i think it's just because pros are super good at learning how to run away from fights and stalling to get minis off and it's just gonna be a third party fest off spawn with not a lot of math as i was watching stiff he was looting up and stuff he would always be creating just random boxes around anything that he farms because he's super careful pro players across the board i see them do this all the time like they're literally just creating boxes just to farm like one simple little thing or open up a chest or anything the third thing is the looting routes about how important those actually are in the game like this especially in final they literally mean everything and i can bet like even in a solo cash cup in like the open lobbies if you can have an amazing loot route that would probably set you up so much faster to get more kills throughout the game in the open since it would be a lot easier to kill the people who aren't that good so the final result he made 200 bucks he ended up getting exactly 30th place and he only had one good game drop a like if you enjoyed this video and stay tuned for more coaching from Ken Beans and even myself getting coached by some pros the goal is to make earnings this season there's a bunch of tournaments left so we got our work cut out for us. Use code Cambians. See you guys in the next video. Peace.